Okay, Scorpio, I think this is going to be the last one today. Okay, so let's see, Scorpio. Scorpio. Ooh, that one wanted to come out. Okay, let's see. You are a badass being full of life, love, and possibilities. Through this deck, you may find a path to your best self. Oh, okay, so... M and W. I feel like those initials might mean something. Okay, so now I'm getting... Some of you might be going towards an air sign is what I'm getting here. Okay, air or fire. And there's going to be communication here. Okay, and what is this? Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so I feel like this could be a prosperous connection here. For some of you, it's an earth or a water sign, but I feel like this represents, what is this, ace of cups. Okay, so for some of you, it is a water sign. That's what I'm getting. A new beginning in love with open-hearted communication. This is prosperous uh, and I feel like you know exactly what to do. I don't think there's a question here. Ace of Cups. New beginning in love. Ooh, tell me more. Okay, so let's see. What signs? Okay, so I've got several already, but um, let's see what the dominant energy is. Sagittarius, Gemini, Pisces, Okay, so what I'm getting here with this is that for some of you, you broke up with somebody. Okay, that's the energy I'm getting here. You broke up with somebody and uh, could have been like uh, back and forth. Okay, and uh, uh, now I feel like on both sides, the dreams didn't match. Okay, is what you feel like. And maybe that's why you both broke up here, but um, I feel like there is not enough vulnerability here. I feel like you're both closed off because you've been hurt in the past and therefore not opening up fully. It's like waiting for the other person to do it. Okay, but the key to success here is you opening up communicating openly right even if it means getting hurt or rejected or feeling like you ha are it's like reaching for that vulnerability right okay and uh saying how you really feel right and i feel like that could bring in easter like the new spring beginning and victory in love now for some of you if you know in your heart you don't want to be with that past person, then what you want to do is re take those elements that you liked about your past and do new dream work, new matrix around framework, around how you want to move in love. Okay. And uh, for some of you, that means getting out of your comfort zone and traveling and releasing any kind of past um, painful energy. Okay, that's what I'm getting.
That's what it takes. But we've got victory with open communication, right? Tangible in the physical. Now for some of you, this Queen of Pentacles could be a Libra or Taurus, Earth sign, water sign again. Some of you, the struggle could have been air sign. All right, that's what I'm getting. Woo, yeah, that's what I got. Okay. Yeah, the struggle was with an air sign for some of you. Okay. Now, it could be a fire sign who was maybe not so positive, right? And, and that's, you had to take a break from love for some of you because of it. Okay, and then here's the emperor. That could be you or the person is also an emperor. But I'm getting that you are. And you, you it's like, are these Capricorn horns or ram horns, right? Okay, so that's the question. Okay. Okay, so at any rate, some of you had to take a step back or step forward away from whatever all that was. Okay, and here is Ace of Swords moving in your truth now. Okay, sometimes it's a process, right? It's like uh, the journey. Okay, and then balancing everything out again in a new uh, reality, new segment. Okay, and some of you are moving move to a place that has seasons colder region that's what i'm getting with this okay and oh and that was a good move for whoever this was because that is opening up new avenues for creativity okay now for some of you this is feeling left out from your past lover and so now you're focusing on work. Okay, so that's two different stories there. Okay. And the key is to move out of your head, right, of whatever that past stuff is and be present in the now. And that's going to bring in this kind of new youthful energy, loving energy, playful energy. And whoever your person is, I feel like is still looking at you. <laughs> okay. All right, and you feel like you don't want to let go. Okay, so um, sometimes the adult stuff can get in the way of uh, true feelings and true intentions, right? Okay, that's what I'm getting here. Okay. Now, perhaps... I'm getting this card as your you. Maybe you are moving too slow for them. They're used to be moving fast because here is even fast communication. So maybe they're used to moving faster than you. Okay, and I feel like you are more like putting on the brakes, going hold your horses. Okay, something like that's coming up. Yeah, and you still want to continue working on your creative uh, stuff, your sparks, okay, your potential. Temperance. So there's that Sagittarius energy again. Okay, so for some of you, this could have been uh, arguments within the family dynamic of your person that you were dating, okay. Okay, so they could have had children, and the difference, if they had children, maybe there was a disagreement about, um, what is that? Um, like sharing custody and that kind of stuff, and maybe you got in the mix for some, some of you. Some of you, this could be like fur babies, it's not humans. Okay, try, having disagreements about that kind of stuff, okay. Caring for fur babies and stuff like that. Okay, now, but here is the Ace of Pentacles. Okay, so I feel like 
see this is what I'm getting okay there's a process in between here and here okay it's a journey and someone okay and this may not be you maybe the other person wants to go faster but you want to move at a steady pace that's what I'm getting okay it's like you want to enjoy it. it's like why rush it right getting something like that okay and here's the ten of Pentacles which is you have the ability to bring it back with this past person or bring in the elements of the past and not be with that person and harmonize with whatever you are battling with that potential is here I see the new versions of what you've been asking for okay what is this okay yeah for some of you this energy you feel like someone was coming at you okay okay and that could even be like I'm getting like um this is camouflage like feeling like um You want to escape from like your a shadowy past, or it could even be like, um, what is that? Um, internet stuff, right? All the chitter chatter that people say online, you got to let that go because that, that you've got to let it go. And by letting all that stuff go, this can uh, come in as soon as now. Okay, but know that here is the Ace of Pentacles and Ten of Pentacles. Okay, so I feel like the story here is you set the pace. Yep. Okay, I reached in and this was the card. Nine of Cups. Okay, so somebody, I don't know who it is, is going at a different pace than you. Okay. and uh, But there is a potential here for a wish fulfillment in the physical Ten of Pentacles here. Let me see what that is. Okay. Yeah, the key is to keep on persevering and not um, give love a chance. That's a message. Okay. Let's get some flowers here, maybe, or a flower. Let's see. Let me reach in. Realization. The answer is here. Take heed. Okay, so, yeah, all it takes is... Um, connecting with your inner being okay endurance hold on you can do this that's what I was feeling okay yeah okay so getting rid of those prickly thoughts right and persevering having endurance okay and another communication card listen and speak with greater care I leave you with that